Okay, on this video, I'm going to be talking about um, the driver's side door not opening remotely. It won't open from the inside. The only way it will open is through or with the key. But um, a lot of people are having this problem with the door not opening sometimes. Well, I, I did make a video with all the, the back two doors are not opening with the key, only ma manually from the inside. And... Um, I'm just gonna make this video to let you guys know that this problem's happening to me, and then when I figure out this problem, I guess I'm gonna have to make a video showing you how I fix the problem. So it will be a upcoming video that I will make in the future. But the problem that I'm having right now is that my driver's side door won't open. So I opened it, and the back one's open. But this one won't open. The only way it will open is with the key. So right there, I opened it with a key. It will open. So if I lock it, I, I locked it. The, the other door is locked, but this one don't lock. And and I, if I do it again, like real hard, it will lock it. And it rolled oh, roll up the window. But my guess is there's a little uh, electronic box in here somewhere i think um it's right here somewhere well inside here in the door it's for the the wireless mechanism to work with the remotely but right now i'm just doing it manually so i think that's the problem but until i figure it out i'll let you guys know exactly what what it is um, on this on the pass on the driver door but the passenger door is okay all, all the other doors are, are okay they're fine and um, yeah so that's the problem that I'm having right now and I'm pretty sure a lot of um, other BMW owners have the same problem so if you have this problem make sure you use the key to, to open it and lock it so I'm gonna lock it right now, but because you have to, um, you have to do it tightly, like or not tightly, real hard. There's, you only go this far to lock it with the remote, like re, um, electronically lock or whatever you want to call it. And if you want to do it manually, you have to do it all the way. So as you can see, it's locked now. And if you want to open it manually, you have to do it. So usually, when you do it um, with the with the I forgot what they're called. I'll put it on the description, or I'll put a little blob thing on here with the name of what I'm talking about. And I'm gonna unlock it. So that's manually. So if you push it all the way to the right, it's manual. If you push it all the way to the left, wait, all the way to the right, is manual. All the way to the left is manual. So all the way to the left, all the way to the right. If you do it halfway, you're just doing, you're, you're using the, the electronic um, thing that it has in here. So I'm gonna lock it. I'm gonna roll up my windows. So the same way you roll up your windows and roll down your windows. So that's unlock. And this is to unlock all the back ones. It is not working on this one, so I'm gonna have to hold it real hard. As you can see, it unlocked. So I'm gonna lock all the other doors. You're gonna hear them lock right now. I do it halfway. They locked, and to do this one manually, you have to push it all the way to the right and there. So, if you ever get locked out of your door on the driver door, to so you won't. There's not a way of doing it. Just make sure you use the manual mode. So just push the key all the way to the left and all the way to the right. If you do it in between, you're doing you're using the electronic mode. So um, yeah, um, that's about it. And um, I'll be putting up other videos later. Okay, thank you for watching. Please give my video a thumbs up. Please comment for any questions and uh, subscribe